Hey beauties and welcome to today's video. Today we're doing something a little bit different. Today we are doing a collab video and we are doing lips and sips with three other channels that I'm going to shout out now. So the first channel is Sub Boxes and Cocktails. She's a great channel. She does a lot of un um, a lot of empties videos. She has a lot of unboxings. She does yard sailing on the weekends. She's just awesome. You guys should check her out if you're interested in something like that. Then there's Hello Amy Cat. Hello Amy Cat is just, she's just the sweetest soul. She does unboxing. She does hauls. She does a little bit of this, a little bit of that. I really love her style because it doesn't matter what she does. I like it. And third, but definitely not last, is my very good friend Manic Makeup Mama. She is great. She does a lot of live unboxings lately which I've been loving she does them she sometimes does coffee and commute with Candace in the morning she is awesome I highly recommend checking her out if you're interested in something like that she's just such a genuine person that I really um, felt gravitated to ever since I met her so check out those lovely ladies and Welcome to my channel if you've never been here before and welcome back if you've been here before. My name is Manders. I am so excited you guys are here. Please stick around if you want to hear me have some talk about my favorite lip products and have some sips. All right, for the first one today, I'm going to talk about my Deck of Scarlet lipstick. This is a liquid lipstick from Deck of Scarlet. It is in the shade Brunch Babe. Now, I pulled this out this morning and I was like oh my goodness you know what I have not wore this in such a long time and I just when I got this I received it as a trio there was Moody Mauve and then I believe the other one was Siren so it came as a pack of three and I just this one's my favorite and it is one of the nicest liquid lipsticks that I've tried lately it's very soft and it dries sort of like a demi matte not fully dry um, it does wear off over time however it's just such a nice finish and it has a nice nice shape doe foot applicator and I just I really love it so this is one this is um, number five so I guess we're gonna count these down in order of how I just feel like ranking them today. Cause honestly, these are just five really good lip products that I wanted to do this video with. And because it is lips and sips, so I'm going to put this one on now. I'm just gonna make sure my lips are dry. My cat is sitting there right now. She never, she's never in here when I film. I'm very interested. If you hear meowing, I apologize. The other one's on the other side of the door. So, my deck of Scarlet in Brunch Babe. So this is Brunch Babe. This is by Deck of Scarlet. I'm sorry, I'm trying not to move because it is a very wet formula. So I want it to dry. I really like how this lipstick looks. I like how it wears, but I especially like just like, it's such a pretty, like, I want to say like pinky peachy nude. Um, it's just very flattering. I like it. It's actually a little bit more, I'm, I haven't worn this in so long. I'm definitely going to put this like back up in my top drawer. But the good thing is that's why I'm doing this video. So I can't remember which one of us, I know it definitely wasn't me who had this idea. Um, as you know, I really... I don't usually have a drink on my channel. However, in the spirit of fun and a collab, I did decide to do it for this one. So it's just a really fun, I thought it was a really nice idea. And I picked five that I never talk about on my channel. So, all right, I'm gonna wipe this one off and I will be back for the next. My second choice um, is a lipstick that I don't really talk about a lot when I'm doing a lot of videos. This is not one that I reach for when I am filming and doing a get ready with me. However, for everyday wear, this one really is a favorite of mine. This is Essence. This is in the shade 06, barely there. It is just the nicest, like, it's just a really nice nude color. Um, I really do enjoy this formula. That I've bought so many of these over the years. Honestly, if there was a lipstick color that I'm going to gravitate towards, you're going to realize that it is probably this one. At one point, I think I had like six different lipsticks that were almost the exact same shade as this. I try really hard to 
do li different lip colors and for my videos I do for the most part however when I'm just going out for everyday looks like honestly this look right now this is even a little bit more dramatic for an everyday look for me but like some lipstick like this um, and just like I'm good to go and some mascara I do love wearing a full face of makeup however I just don't like I try and keep it as light as I possibly can so I'm gonna put it on now because that's what this is we're gonna have a sip and then we're gonna put some lips on there we go that is seriously like I just really like this color um, I think it's it's just easy to wear um, it's not too light it's not too dark it's just kind of in between for my skin tone and I really do enjoy it so this is my essence and it is my baby it was probably like the first lipstick I ever really bought was this kind like this I think this is old packaging like I don't know my makeup collection has grown so much over the last little while that I'm like oh, remember when I only had like this many of something and now I'm like holy crap they're multiplying so lipsticks included but so we I'm going to turn off the camera I'll be right back with lipstick number three and now lipstick number three this is by Wander Beauty and I feel like I don't think I've ever even talked about it on my channel and I was going through my collection because this um, video has been in the works for a little while and we really wanted to plan like I wanted to plan out which ones I chose and why I chose each one so that's and then I went through this and I was like I really remember like when I got this it's a dual ended one that's awesome um, and it's just like perfect this is the perfect size lipstick for me because I don't think I've ever used an entire lipstick has anyone ever used a whole lipstick Cause I personally have never used an entire lipstick I don't know like this is like too many ones and I just really like them um, I am going to put them on I'm just I'll show you the th the swatch colors right here so that's the first one and that is in the shade girl boss so I'm gonna put that one on first and because I want to keep this video completely true as to how I would wear this lipstick the truth is I would never wear just one of them I've always mixed them and I've always preferred it that way so I'm just going to show you how I do that so this is the next one though this is in the shade misbehave so it's a nice nude it's just a little bit on the light side for my liking but I find if I mix them together then I'm just perfectly satisfied so And there we go so this is Wander Beauty I really don't own any other makeup products by Wander Beauty I only own skincare so I really like this it's a win for me it's the only thing is when you do drink you want to make sure you wipe it off first um, so for example I'll take a drink and I'll show you what my cup would look like So it's not transfer proof that's the downside however just for like honestly I took a sip right after I put it on if I waited probably like a half an hour before drinking anything it would be pretty dried down that I would still see color at the end of the day not as much as I do now however I would still see some color so that is why I do like this it's just a great lipstick for just going to work because I don't care if my lipstick wears off but it's a bonus if it lasts a little bit longer so perfect for work I am going to wash this one off now and I will be back for number four and we are back for number four so for number four I picked my wet n wild mega last liquid cat suit this is the liquid lipstick and it is in the shade berry recognize so I really like this I really like this shade and I really like this formula if you saw my top 10 or my top five lip lipsticks I do believe I chose a different shade but I um, but the same brand so I can't remember what color it was I didn't pick that one this one for that video for the reason that this one's just a little bit more bold it's not an everyday color for me but I do really love it it's, it's just a really nice deep berry shade so I'll put it on I actually first I love 
this applicator so much. It's just, it fits perfectly. I'm just gonna give that a second to dry. It does dry down quite well. It is pretty long wearing as well. That's also the other thing. These are kind of going in order of like how long they last, except the deck of Scarlet definitely lasts longer than the Essence, but they're definitely starting to get more liquid lipstick as we go through this line. Um, this, I do like this one. It's a little bit sticky when you first put it on, however, it goes away really quickly for me, so I do enjoy it. Like, I can get over it for a few minutes. And, like, already, like, it's pretty dry. And, like, I kind of was dragging my finger there. So, it's a really nice lipstick. Um, I do enjoy the formula. I'm not... I don't reach for it as much as I want to, but I do reach for it quite a bit when I want a fun, vibrant color. So, actually, no. If I was going to pick something fun, this is probably... The funnest I'm getting right now um, as far as vibrancy goes so this is definitely a win if you guys haven't checked it out and you don't have an issue with wet and wild because I know a lot of people do um, and that's totally fine if you have a problem with them I have no problem with that I don't have a problem with it that's just me um, but I really do like their lipsticks a lot like a lot a lot a lot so that's number four and I'll show you on my glass now See, there's nothing like there's no transfer on this so it's a really nice lipstick actually so now there's nothing coming off oh I didn't swatch it on my hand I'll swatch it on my hand so I actually washed off like the um there's like a little stain there so that's this one that one looks all right so I am going to now wash this one off and I'll be right back because this is probably going to be very shocking. It certainly is shocking to me. And I don't know if that's like, I don't know why it's so shocking, but I was a little bit surprised I picked this. I wanted to dig through my collection and I wanted to find something. This is Jeffree Star. And it's funny because I like haven't drank any of this yet. A little bit. So I've chose my Jeffree Star lipstick in clout. I have another Jeffree Star lipsticks that, that's just pink that probably would have been the more... How do you... How do I want to put this? The more Mander's Choice. Well, I'm trying something different and I want to be a little bit crazier than I normally am. And I mean that in a good way. And I mean that I've never actually wore this lipstick on camera for sure. And I can't even be sure that I put it on and then talked after. Like, I think I just put it on and then wiped it right off. So it is the most gorgeous shade. Like, honestly, it's, and I've always wanted, I've always wanted to do this. I've always wanted to swatch a Jeffree Star lipstick on my channel. Um, it's literally just never, I don't have a collection, so I just never really did. But so this was the perfect opportunity. I had my shade Diva set aside for this video. And at the last minute I thought, no, I'm going to step out of my comfort zone and I'm going to do this because I would never like, and it, there's nothing I would like, no color that I wouldn't wear just to try it on. Like maybe I'm going to love this. Maybe, maybe I'll wear it to work tomorrow. You never know. It could happen. It would like, I don't even think anybody would say anything to me if I showed up wearing this lipstick. So let's put it on. I am going to put a second layer on because holy smokes. Is it ever pretty? And I have to say, the formula is so smooth. And the applicator is really similar to the shape of the Wet n Wild one. However, it's just, it's a little bit, almost more, 
I don't know, maybe more flexible. <sighs> now that I'm doing this, I'm like, I want to order more. Like, I really, I've always wanted to order more Jeffree Star products. I just, I haven't really bought anything. I almost bought, I wanted to buy the Jawbreaker palette, but I probably, I'm going to wait. Like I said, I'm going to wait. I could have bought it. I was allowed to. Like there was no, there was no reason I couldn't buy it is what I mean to say. But, um, I made a, I made a vow. I wasn't buying anything for the month of June and I still have, I still have a few days left, but I'm so happy that I did that. So moral of the story, I want way more of these. These are the Jeffree Star ones. But you know what? I also want more of the Deck of Scarlet ones. And I also, I love these ones. And I love this Wander Beauty and I love this Essence. So even though I'm wearing the Jeffree Star one right now and that is the one I'm finishing the video up with, it doesn't necessarily mean it is my favorite. It just means that these are the top five that I wanted to talk to you about while we had lips and sips. So that's from the Wander. Nothing else has left a real lipstick mark, so let's ch test the Jeffree Star. So, that makes me happy. So, thank you guys so much for hanging out with me. Let me know in the comments below and give me a thumbs up if you like this kind of video. Um, I know it was very different for me and I'm pretty sure it's going to be an interesting ride. Um, thank you for sticking it out with me and thank you guys so much for being subscribed to me and thank you so much for coming and hanging out with me all the time here. I cannot wait to see you in my next video. Let me know in the comments below what you think of Jeffree Star's clout and what you think of the other lips that I decided to do and I will list all of the ladies that are in this collab in the description box below. If you're looking for somebody who maybe you, like if you want to hang out with somebody that I think that their stuff is great and that they're worth checking out please do it. If not that's fine. Um, thank you guys so much for hanging out with me today. I love doing this videos. I love you ladies. Thank you so much for doing this collab with me. I'm just hanging out in my little makeshift makeup room with my essential oils diffusing behind me and having some lips and some sips. So thank you guys for hanging out with me and I will see you in the next one.